Hello everyone, thanks so much for logging on to CBSDenver.com. I am Michael Spencer here at Lambeau Field where the Broncos fall to 0-3 on Sunday courtesy of a 27-16 loss at the hands of the Green Bay Packers. The big story in this one, three turnovers for the Broncos offense and they came at costly times. The game was tied 10-10 with a little less, a little more rather than two minutes to go in the second quarter when Joe Flacco was sacked. He fumbled the ball, Green Bay able to punch it in and took a seven point lead into the locker room. Then the Broncos got the ball to start the second half, turned it over, Green Bay would score on that one, 14 points in total off of those three turnovers. That the big difference in this this game for the Broncos. In fact, the Broncos offense actually looks pretty good. Denver with a season high 149 rushing yards. Philip Lindsay found the end zone twice, but those three turnovers a real killer. The other big story, six sacks. That is what the Broncos allowed. That is not good. More than 50 yards in sacks is what the Packers defense had against the Broncos. And then the Broncos defense in turn, still no sacks and no turnovers. That has been the storyline through three weeks for this Broncos defense. Broncos becoming just the first team to have back to back to back weeks without a sack and without a turnover since the sack was a official stat all the way back in 1982. So obviously uh, some need for improvement there. Emmanuel Sanders saying after the game that the Broncos are currently, quote, living in a world of suck, end quote. Up next, a visit from the Jacksonville Jaguars Sunday afternoon at Mile High. Jacksonville 1-2 and two on the season. Broncos currently 0-3.